Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. I am Teresa. This is my channel, Just Teresa. Welcome to my would you, where, where is it? Where is it? Would you rather challenge? Would you rather? That is the name of this challenge, y'all. Now, would you rather challenge has been around for years and years, you know, but I used to love answering the questions. I always thought that that challenge was so much fun. The difference is this time I'm not taking somebody else's questions. I am using my own. <laughs> so I have created my own questions. Now, is that to say you may not never see that question anywhere in the universe? No, but I can't watch everybody's would you rather over the last 10 decades. Okay. So I, it took me over a week, a week and a half to get the best would you rather that I could come up with? And I really hope that y'all have fun with it. I'm definitely going to be challenging some direct people at the end of this video. But even if I don't tag you, I am challenging everybody who watches this to go ahead and do the would you rather challenge. Use my questions, tag my name in the video so I can see it. You know, you got to have the bell on for me and stuff like that. Um, tag me in it because I'm the one who's presenting it to you as a challenge. And let's just have fun with it. It's, let's just have fun. If you don't know me, all my information is in the description box below. My Instagram is there. My PO box. I love friend mail. Um, you know, just anything that you need to know about me, it's down in the description box. Hit the bell, hit subscribe and stick with me. All right. Now bear with me, bear with me with these questions. I'm going to do it first so you can see how this works. And then um, you guys can copy and paste it. Let me know that in the comments, you know, if you're going to be doing this challenge with my questions, I think that would be so much fun and stay tuned so you can see who I challenge at the end of this, and, you know, a more a direct challenge, even though I'm challenging everybody, there is a few people I want to call out on this challenge, but I really want to hear your feedback. If you thought it was fun or what did you think? Okay. All right. So would you rather is exactly that. What that means is I'm going to ask you a question. Everything's going to start, would you rather? So almost, would you rather ride a red bike or would you rather ride a blue bike? You know what I mean? So you're picking, you're letting me know what it is you'd rather do. Except for the questions for me that I made, because I created these questions, is a little bit deeper than what color bike would you want to, you know what I mean? So you're just choosing. It's simple, simple, simple. I hope y'all love this little background I made with the would you rather. All right, first question. I'm going to answer these truthfully, okay? But I want you to do it with your truth. You know, not my truth, your truth. We may have some of the same answers. Who knows? Here you go. Would you rather, number one, would I rather listen to the same song every day for the rest of my life or would I rather have no music at all for the rest of my life? Now that is a good one. Okay, think about that, you guys. In some of these questions, you really do need to think, and I really want you to take a second. You don't have to rush the video. Take a second and think about it. This question is kind of, of a deep question. Would you rather listen to the same song, and I'm not talking about once a week or when you feel like it, every day. That is the only song you're gonna be able to hear. Same song every day. Or is that gonna drive you so crazy that you don't want no music at all in your life at all for the rest of your life. Uh, me, for me, I can't go with no music at all. So I'm going to play the same song every day for the rest of my life. If it kills me, <laughs> you are going to get sick of it. And I'm not talking about you could go turn it off. No, every day that song is going to play. Every day it's going to play. Every day. So it's going to drive you crazy. Do you think it's better than not having any music at all? It might drive me crazy, me crazy but I am taking the same song every day. I don't want to go with no music ever in life. Okay. Number two, would you rather, which you is me in this case, would you rather kiss a frog or would you rather kiss the ugliest man? If you're a woman, then you'll say, man, whatever is choose man or woman, or would you rather kiss the ugliest man in the world? Would I rather kiss a frog or kiss the, the world's ugliest man. <laughs> I don't like either. I am not an animal person and I ain't ugly. I'm not a, 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 a wanna kiss an ugly person, but you gotta make a choice. Hmm. I think with me, 
Ooh. I don't know if I could kiss the ugliest man in the world. Like, oh. um, but, but could I kiss a frog? I think frogs are harmless. I think I'll take the frogs. <laughs> Is that wrong, y'all? That's so wrong. But I'm going to take the frog. I can't wait to hear what you guys are going to do. All right. Question number three. Would you rather be rich but stink and it cannot be fixed ever for the rest of your life? You can't buy it away. You can't go to a surgeon. You're going to stay stanky for the rest of your life. There is no fixing it. No matter how much money you have, because don't forget, would you rather be rich but stink for the rest of your life? Or would you rather be poor but never stink? Okay, so you can have all this money in the world, but you're going to stink worse than the worst skunk that ever came in the room and you can't fix it. There is nothing you can do. There's no amount of money. You can't fix it. Or would you rather be poor because you just can't do the stink, honey? Because if you're poor, then you won't stink. There's no stink at all if you're poor. Or would you rather, rather be rich and be funky? <laughs> you know? Take a minute and think about that, you guys. For me, and like I said, everybody have their own individual answers. But for me, I think I'd rather be rich and stink because if I'm rich, people are going to hang out with me if I'm stinky or not. You can sit over there. You can sit over there. But I need some money. <laughs> That's just my answer. And I'm sticking to it because I would rather be rich. OK, bitch. <laughs> All right. Next question. Oh, my God. Would you rather smack a puppy out of a five-year-old kid's hand? <laughs> yes, smack a puppy. Just smack the puppy. Would you rather smack a puppy out of a five-year-old's hand or would you rather smack the cat out of an old lady's hand? An elderly little grandma. Yeah, I love cats. I love my cats. <laughs> Okay, would you rather, which one would y'all rather do? Would you rather smack a puppy out of a five-year-old kid's hand? Or would you rather smack a cat out of an old lady's hand? <laughs> Personally, these old ladies, for me, my answer is going to have to be, I'd rather smack that cat puppy out of the kid, a five-year-old's hand. That kid is going to be okay. He going to cry. He going to throw a fit. And three minutes later, he going to be okay. But that old lady, they are attached to their cats. She might be traumatized, honey. So I pick smack it out that puppy out the five-year-old's hands. Okay, I'm dirty and I'm wrong for that. But don't judge me. You got to pick one. <laughs> that puppy getting smacked. Smacked. <laughs> like Shanene said. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Number five. Would you rather eat only chicken for one year? One year. Only thing you can eat every single day of your life is chicken. I don't care how you make it, but it's got to be chicken. <laughs> or, or would you rather eat no chicken at all for a whole year? You just can't stand the thought of eating chicken every day. So you'd rather have no chicken. That is a good question because I am a chicken person, but could I eat it every day for a whole year? Woo! That is tough. Y'all better think about that one. Um, or could I go with no chicken at all for a whole year? Personally, I will just eat that. For me, my answer is I'm going to eat that chicken every day for a year. Only the chicken, nothing else, just chicken. Okay. So I got to do that. I'm just going to make it in a hundred different ways, but I'm going to make it through those 365 days. Okay. Cause I don't want to go with no chicken at all for a year. Are you kidding me? No, honey, no baby. <laughs> no, 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 no. So I am going to go with eat the chicken every day for a year. Yes. Woo. Next question. Number six, it's only 10. So we're almost there. Hang in there. Sit down. Number six. Would you rather go into the past and meet your ancestors? Now, listen to me, y'all. Would you rather go into the past and meet your ancestors or would you rather go into the future and meet your great grandchildren that you might have otherwise not have been here for? So would you rather go into the past and meet your ancestors 
or go into the future and meet your great grandchildren? Great question. Think about it. It took me a while to think of that question. Um, I think for me, I'm so infatuated with history that I think I'm going to try to go in the past and see what my my ancestors been through. I would love to just pop up like a spirit <laughs> and see what they went through back in slavery days and how they were living. So I'm going to pick going in the past because I'm hoping and praying if I live long enough, I might can see my grandchildren, you know, but I don't know, maybe not. Cause actually the question is great, great grandchildren. So you might not be here. So make a choice. My choice is I want to go in the past. I got to see my ancestors, some grandparents, their parents, and just, I just want to know. I'm just that nosy. Great. Now, next question. Number seven, would you rather have more time in life or would you rather have more money in life so time meaning would you just like to have more time almost living to eternity if you want because you're adding time to your life being here on this earth more time just as much time as you want or would you rather have more money in life um Good question. Good question. Uh, I hope y'all are liking my questions. Um, I think that I would rather, one question has nothing to do with the other. So don't, don't, don't mix them all up and all of that. Each question is an individual question. Okay. Um, I think, I think I'd rather have, Ooh, that's a good one. More time or more money. I think I'd rather have more time in life because I want to live a long time. I want to be here for all my kids and their kids and their kids' kids as long as I possibly can be here. So I think I'm going to go with more time because I don't want to die. So let's do more time for me. I can't wait to see y'all answers. All right. We only got like three more. All right. Would you rather have a rewind button on your life? Rewind Replay, I wanna take all of that back. Let me rewind. Or would you rather have a pause button on your life? So we're not getting rid of stuff. You just taking a pause. You don't want nothing going on. Pause, pause. Or would you have rather have a rewind button? Think about that. That's a really good question. Would you rather have a rewind, rewind button on your life? Or would you rather have a pause button in your life? Um, I think, I think, uh, ooh, that's a good one. I don't know if I would want to rewind. Um, yeah, all because one of my favorite sayings is don't look back because you're not going that way. So I'm going to say I'll take a pause because honestly, I would love, love to pause 2020 and this damn coronavirus. Now, some of you might want to rewind. Maybe you lost some people in your life or whatever. So it, every, every answer is different. But then again, if I could rewind, I could get my mother and my father back. Oh, and all my nieces and nephews and everybody that's passed away that I love. So it's kind of a deep question. So I might have to change my answer because I will rewind it back to when we were all alive and we were all here and all together. So I take that back. I do want a rewind button in my life. I want to bring back everybody that I love, make it so that it never happened. So that is my answer. But some people may just want to pause it. This 2020 might be too much. Just want to pause. Just pause. I don't want to do nothing else. Just leave me alone. Pause. Good question. I hope y'all give me an honest answer. All right. We just got two more left. Would you rather go deep sea diving or would you rather go bungee jumping? Okay. I am a person who would not rather do either one, you know, but we got to pick one. You got to play the game. So would I rather go deep sea diving or would I rather go bungee jumping? I love to swim. Now, I don't know about no deep sea diving, honey. And that bungee from the Empire State Building or whatever they're going to set that bungee up. Oh, Lord, Lord, Lord. But I think if I had to choose, you are hooked up to a rope 
in the bungee jump. So maybe I will just pray, but I'm going to take bungee jumping. I don't want to do deep sea diving. Now, if you're a fish and you can swim that good, the sea dive might be okay. But for me, I think I'm going to go with the bungee jumping. I'll take my chances and please play, pray for me. Please, please, please. <laughs> and the last question, whoop, whoop, is the last question. Whoop, whoop. Okay, here we go, y'all. Okay. Would you rather end hatred in the world? Would you rather end all the hatred in the world? Or would you rather end all the hunger in the world? Now, I'm going to need y'all to really think about that because that is an amazing question. And I'm going to need y'all to think about that, okay? If you could end hatred, would that be what you choose? Because there's a lot of hatred in this world, a lot of racism and hatred and just evil people, murderers, rapers. That's a deep question. But there's also a lot of homeless. There's also a lot of hungry people who's not even homeless. They just don't got money. Which one would you rather end? I would be so excited to see what you guys answers are because I know a lot of my followers, y'all are so intelligent and you really think things out. Um, I think for me, both of these are so important. I wish I could just take both, but you can't. So because my passion is always the homeless or the needy and giving back, I'm going to say that I personally wish I could end all the hunger in the world. I would love to be able to, to snap my finger and end all the hatred, but, um, I think that I think I have to go with my passion, which is an answer for me. I'm going to go with in hunger in the world. That is it, y'all. <laughs> I made it through. Thank you for sitting through this premiere with me. I really appreciate you guys. I can't wait to see who does it. Now, I did challenge everybody. So anybody can take this challenge and go ahead and do it on your channel. But please do me a favor and just tag me as the person who presented the challenge to you. Okay? But the people I want to directly call out, I want to call out House of Entertainment X. Oh, I got to get them two back. That is your boy, Leo, and it's me, Wanston. Hello. You guys are being challenged. It's a challenge. <laughs> So House of Entertainment X, definitely got to call them out. You know I got to call out my baby girl. D-Marie Love, let's get it right now, honey. Right now. <laughs> okay. You have been challenged. I also want to call out, who would like this? Oh, I want to call out Really TT. Come on, Really TT. You know you got this, sis. I'm going to call out, um, who else? I don't know. Some people I don't think will do it. There's some people I have in mind, but I don't know if they'll do it. Um, I'm going to call out Vern's junk closet anyways. We'll see if she'll do it. I'm not sure if she will. But Vern, you have been challenged, sis. Okay. And that's four. I want to think of one more person to challenge. Um, I think that I would, because this person is so deep all the time. I would love to hear I am content's answers to this challenge. So I am content. You have been challenged. <laughs> Those are my direct people that I'm challenging. But like I said, I'm challenging everybody who watches this video. Please do me a favor. All of you go ahead and do this challenge. It took me weeks to come up with these questions and I would really like to see it get out there in the atmosphere. Make sure you tag me so that I'll know that you're doing it and have fun with it. I can't wait to see y'all answers and have a good day. Bye. Don't forget my favorite saying, don't look back because you ain't going that way. Look forward. No looking back. We're not going that way. We're not going that way. Always go forward in life. Okay. Bye. Love y'all.